This video is sponsored by Femoid.com, the best way to get social media followers in just one click. Hello everyone, welcome back to our YouTube channel Tech Lenses and in this video we will show you the unboxing and installation process of SK Hynix 8GB RAM for laptops. We have bought this product from Amazon priced at around 4200 rupees. You can know more about this product by checking the link given in the description. Product comes in a plastic package having a bubble wrap inside for protection. There is only an invoice page and actual product inside the package. The outer pack of the product clearly mentioned that this ROM comes with a lifetime warranty, maximum of 10 years. That's look a plus point here. Okay, now let's bring out the actual RAM. Opening the RAM, you will see the RAM mentioning all the details sticked on it. Uh, we recommend you to not rip off the stick details on it uh, as it will be required for the warranty purposes later on. Talking about the product, this is basically a DDR3L type of RAM made for the low consumption type of laptops. Going in depth, uh, let's see the specification. Power supply of 1.3 pi volt, uh, background compatible with uh, 1.5 volt DDR3 module, 1600 megahertz of frequency 204 pins. Before you buy a RAM, make sure it is supported by your laptop. Mainly three things uh, should match with your laptop hardware that are power supply, its frequency and number of pin. You can check the details of your laptop's hardware using uh, CPU-Z app. Now comes the installation process. Attach the pin in a proper way and then click downwards. You will hear a click sound meaning it get attached successfully. Before you doing this step, make sure you completely switch off your laptop. For the safety purpose, you can also pull off your laptop battery. We are not doing that, uh, just uh, putting on the cover, uh, setting up the screws and uh, switching on the laptop. Once the laptop gets completely booted, go to computer properties by right clicking on computer from the start menu and then clicking properties. As you can see the second RAM has been successfully installed. If you have any question regarding this video feel free to ask us in the comment section. Also subscribe to our channel for the upcoming videos. This is Kunal signing off. Thanks for watching.